Really our best evidence comes from the footprint record because the dinosaur footprints are very, very common all over the world. And if you go out and you look at them, you can see flocks of dinosaurs moving in one direction. And not only moving in one direction because that it, you could say, well, you know, that this is a, a mud flat, right? And you have a dinosaur walks down there one day and then its brother walks down there the next day and stuff. So it's preserving it over a number of days. But in many cases, you can tell by the pattern of overlap of, of the tracks themselves that uh, they were made at the same time, or a group of animals which uh, you know, are walking straight and they're undulating from right to left and stuff and tracking each other. So we have pretty strong evidence that uh, several different groups of dinosaurs you know, traveled in flocks. Now, did they all do? No. I mean, just like mammals. I mean, mammals today that we have some animals which herd, we have other animals which are solitary. So it's not they all did, but uh, certainly we have evidence that some kinds did.